Although the summer is soon beginning, I just review these watches as they come. So we are going to talk about the Bioka today, which is the SBGW 285's inspiration. Bioka is the time when summer transitions into autumn, and the first morning dew appears. Of course, the wind will feel cool against your skin. In Shizukuichi, where this piece is made, the summer is short and the transition occurs at the end of August, with early signs of autumn in the air. The green leaves on the trees are increasingly dark at this time, and that is what this dial represents. But will the SBGW 285 capture this time period perfectly on your wrist? Or is this just another dark dial piece to forget about? Let's find out. What's up everyone, it's Chris with Little Treasury Channel, where we bring you original and in-depth watch content at least once a week. If you haven't already, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell to be alerted as soon as we upload. I'm from Little Treasury Jewelers, which is located in Gambrels, Maryland. And it's where you go when you're in the know. As always, the watches that I review are for sale and can be purchased, so please see the description below to contact us. If you're just joining us now, I'll go over the watch's detailed measurements and features, and then I'll offer my humble opinion at the end. In our last video, I reviewed the Oris ProPilot X Caliber 400. Now, yes, this is an Oris watch, so it's not a Grand Seiko, but I really encourage you all to check this one out because it really is interesting and has some great features. It's a great package overall with a Caliber 400. It's all titanium, a fascinating dial. So please, I encourage you to take the time and at least give this video a shot. Otherwise, it's going to be hard for me to keep doing other brands out there. So please, Support the channel in that way. I really appreciate it. Wrist check time. Today, it's a Grand Seiko video, so here's my Grand Seiko Snowflake, SPGA 211. While many other interesting pieces are always coming out, I can't help but still love my Snowflake. It really is a perfectly balanced piece. Now, tell me which watch you're wearing while you're watching this video, and make sure to tell me why. Now, let's get on to the features. The SPGW 285 has a 36.7 millimeter case width and 11.8 millimeter thickness, a 43.8 millimeter lug to lug, an 18.9 millimeter lug width, a 31.8 millimeter crystal diameter, and weighs in at 62.08 grams. The case is Zeratsu polished completely on the bezel, lugs, and sides. A non-screw down crown can be found at the three position and has GS on the top of it. The sapphire crystal is box style and protrudes above the case to protect it from scratches. The dial is in the very special Kirazuri texture, which means sparkling painting. It is inspired by the Japanese Kirazuri painting technique, which involves adding glittering flakes of mica to print, which results in a glittering dynamic surface. The Kirazuri texture and dark green color are designed to invoke the dark green of the leaves at the end of summer. The markers are all beautifully polished and are rectangular, with a double marker at the 12, 3, 6, and 9 markers. Minute ticks can be found in white along the edge of the dial. The GS logo is applied in white at the top middle portion with Grand Seiko in white beneath it. The hour and minute hands are Dolphin style and are finished immaculately. And the second hand is in silver on this piece. Nothing else can be found on this dial and it is completely minimalist and clean. And of course no loom since the markers will pick up light until it is very dark. The case back has a sapphire display which allows you to see the 9S64 movement. The SPGW 285 uses the 9S64 movement, which is a manual wind. It is accurate to between losing 3 and gaining 5 seconds per day. It has a 72 hour power reserve and beats at 28,800 beats per hour. It has a total of 24 joules. The strap is made out of crocodile with a beautiful tight grain and is in green with no visible stitching. It has a simple Grand Seiko tang buckle. The Grand Seiko SPGW285 is splash resistant or 50 meter water resistant, is part of Grand Seiko's current elegance collection, and can be yours for a price of $4,800. Now for my personal opinion. I'm not really used to smaller watches, but I can totally understand the appeal of a thin, small, lightweight, and simple piece such as this that has a fascinating dial. The color is dark, but pretty fascinating in different lighting environments. I really think that the band on this is even the star of the show and reminds me of a Ninja Turtle skin or a Dragon Scale. It's really beautiful. The simplicity of this is great and you just wind it and you just wear it and no date to care about either. I'm glad to see that this is one of Grand Seiko's non-limited pieces and this will be available going forward for now because it is really an interesting piece. I will recommend this one for anyone who is looking for a clean and beautiful dress watch 
and perhaps is looking for a green addition to your collection or someone who really appreciates the end of the summer. Thanks for watching today, everyone. I really hope that you enjoyed the video. And of course, if you did, please make sure to hit that subscribe button, give this video a like, and share it with all of your friends and your family members too. I look forward to seeing you next video.